supply all the info we need. Let's um, let's do it here. Thankfully, um, he's got his. Um, well, I guess I guess we can. I'm glad we can hear him. A little messy here. This is fine. Get in there. No, skip the pro. Okay, yeah, get out of there. All right. So we're losing some time. Okay, what are we doing here? We're not going to throw anything. Hold on. Hold on. We need to... And we're going to lose that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so this is... This is at least... This isn't beyond an inaccuracy. This is a mistake at this point. He did get rid of some of his hearts, but he's not going to get rid of all of them. Wait, is he going to get rid of all of them? Maybe I'm a dummy. No, he doesn't get rid of all of them. All right, so this is this is a mistake. So the mistake is is that like there's you only just hear me. You don't hear the background. Maybe because it's too. I just got turned up. Let me know if you can hear it now. It may have been too much in the lower in the background with the desktop audio. Yeah. Okay, it was just quiet. Yeah, 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 it's my bad. I usually don't have it set up for this. Yo, a sick cape, though. Alright, so the the intro is a bit of a mistake because he missed um he missed an item. He missed the cross. It's not a big deal, though. So let's see how he approaches this here. I know he has a setup to level up, I think. Yeah, he's going to stop here. So this is... We're going to... Oh, he goes to the side to this. He's, okay, he kills one bat. not work at all. So we're going to say this is good as long as he skips death. Ah. But why didn't he stop in there? Okay, hold on. What we need to pause this for a second. Wait, wait. Actually, we'll just see this. I know he uses this. This is on purpose. And he gets through. Okay. So so what's going on here? It's not that big. He's missing what? M. Yeah, but we don't know if it's a library card or whatever. And he lost the cross, which is kind of problematic. I just think it's a mistake because I don't understand why he wouldn't throw anything beforehand. Like may it maybe it's a maybe it's a case of he wants to have more damage later on, but usually at least jettison a couple of things. But it worked for him, so you know maybe we're being a bit harsh there. Maybe we're gonna call it an accuracy. Let's do that. Oh, I didn't even realize that the name is different because it comes up as the same color, the, the same color. Yo, Tygon man, what's going on? All right, and we're gonna say this is good here. We're gonna say this is good because he got past death. And that's all that matters here. There's better setups for what's going on, but what Fittikis is doing here is he's purposely killing a bat to manipulate his experience so that he levels up off the final ward so that he can buffer the jump into death to make it more consistent. The um, How do you um, define the difference? It's kind of like um, when we were doing it before, um, it kind of depends. Like inaccuracy is like something that doesn't really have a big deal. The uh, like, like there's something that you could do better but um, it doesn't really um, have a huge impact. Mistake is like there's been like a material difference, like um, and like it was like definitely like achievable. Like we could have done something differently. The um, we'll see that especially if we make like like poor routing decisions based on at least the the stuff that we see. The um, that I mean by logic and stuff. Yeah, like suboptimal. And then blunder is just like big mistakes. Like um, I don't know. Let's say you get like, and I haven't seen this run, so I don't know how it works out. But let's say you get um. You get holy glasses at like spike breaker and you have everything but one check and you never got echo and then you go and do the last check and then echo yeah it's a mistake but not a big one yeah i just like the other thing too with 50 keys is that um because he's not um as experienced of a runner as well like i need to make sure i take that into account like it would have been a bigger mistake for someone who's like been more seasoned into it like, and he doesn't probably need to, like, focus too much on it, as long as he gets through it. Yo, 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 Matthias, let's go, man. So let's keep her going. The biggest thing is, he lost the cross, which kind of sucks, but at least in Lycanthrope, the, um, the, um, whatchamacallit, um, the Mystic Pendant, um, mitigates that. It'll be a bigger problem if he needs the Soul Steel and he can't do it. And then his intro is good. Like, it's not optimal by any stretch of the imagination, but he gets past death. That's all that matters. Like, losing to death is the biggest problem. So he solved for that. So let's keep her going here. In a row today, missing the last jump. Now, do you want to have their chatter here? Because oh, I'm hoping yeah, that he, he gets a bit introspective. Him. Yeah, we could be doing some more yeah. shield dashing and stuff like that. I'm getting those skips, though, okay, those attack skips potion's are... amazing. We need to remember we have that. Row, and javelin. Okay, javelin doesn't matter. I'm going to write down a list there he has attack potion. 
He's checking this. Okay, that's fine. You know what? It's better to attack potions. So good. Yeah, you need to more more shield dashing. Yeah, I took some time for practicing. We haven't seen into his menu yet, and we don't know. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. What are we doing here? Hold on. What are we doing here? You don't have the stuff. You must have thought he had leapstone or something. Okay, my control is. Luck potions again. stinks. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah, jumping up there, he must have thought he had it. Okay, he's just gonna take the damage boost there. That's fine. So hold on a second. It's fine that he takes the damage boost there. Like I, I kill the guy now, but um, this is gonna be too far back. But like Seriously? the biggest thing I'd say right now, and I don't want to put up as like a like a mistake or something like that, but like he's not shield dashing at all. Yeah, maybe you can beat the skeleton to hit you up there. I don't. Yeah, no one's looked up to that. I don't. Oh, we're doing. Oh, the IQ check. No, don't do it. No, what is it? Oh, it's pictures of dad. Okay, we got to write that down too. Power of sire is good. Yeah, I think the best way through that room, though, is um, anti-venom too. I'm gonna write that down because he's got he's got iframes. frames. Oh, but he got poisoned. Oh no, no, no! This is bad news. But here's the fun thing: I was I'm working on a um, a video for stats, and because stats are so closely tied to um, um, statistic or like um, statuses, at least with um, constitution. So I'm repping through that as well. Oh, yeah, that's a good question. So let's do that. So what is IQ check and why is it bad? So that's an amazing question. Let me um, bring this back over here. So IQ check is this check coming up here. It's kind of a meme. So it's over here. So the breaking the wall, can you see? Yeah, you can see my mouse. So breaking this wall and looking for the item, it takes about like three or four seconds. Yeah, it's it's really not good, not bad. Like to me, I'm gonna skip it probably every time. The um, because like it's like you know I don't know, just keep going, and especially in lycanthrope. So we're gonna see this later, but um, he might have a good opportunity to go up the the to the clock room, and like so if he's trying to do it now, he's not gonna make it. Like he's he's not going fast enough. He needs to um. He needs to be shield dashing more, which I say like the biggest problem I'm seeing right now. The um, but like to lose like a three or four second tempo, and then um, for like an item, and like usually like I'll skip it in safe, but I mean especially in lycanthrope, like your game state right now is fantastic. You've got a shield, a shield rod, um, brilliant mail, which is great, especially if you get a sub weapon later. The, um, you have a cape. It doesn't like it's blood cloak, but I mean, like, any cape is good. I wouldn't menu for a cape at all. And you have the mystic pendant. Like your game state at this point of the game is fantastic. So if you can save like five seconds or so on an item check and then do that four times, that's twenty seconds. That's the difference between my last race with with fire. I mean, we're probably not going to get that nick picky with um with fifty keys here. But um, it's just a it's just a way to to gain an additional tempo and stuff like that. Yeah, exactly. You've got all you need. Like the only thing you're looking for is like a better shield. But there's going to be two in the shop. The um, like library card, mana prism, duplicator, and like some good weapon. But you'll like find those. So yeah, like it just mo mainly like like going into here is just like it's going to take you three or four seconds to to do it. Or actually, we can time this. So let's see his timer here is right now at three minutes and seven seconds, right? And this is the point in time he'd be able to start jumping onto this platform. So every time until he starts jumping onto the platform from the left side is lost time. So let's take a look at that here. Oh, he actually jumps up there, which might be faster. I'm not sure. So he goes into here. He gets the pictures of dad. So like here's about when you can do it. So he lost like what, like, what was that? Like seven or eight seconds. Just to get pictures of dad, the um, eight. Okay, eight seconds. So pictures of dad are good. Like to be fair, that um, yeah, it's a lot of time. Eight seconds. Yeah, seven seconds with better movement, right? Yeah, chaos Fanny, You know, yeah, get those pictures of dad in there. So pictures of dad is probably one of the nicest things you can find there because it it just solves problems. Like generally, you may not use it, but like if he has to fight Grand Falloon with this um, 
with this just the shield rod and his intelligence, then p- whipping out pictures of dad's going to save that eight seconds for sure. The um, so he did pretty well here by getting it, but um, but still, it's it's uh, that's this is what we talk about the IQ check. It was the thing that Talik had made up just to say, like, you know, you probably don't need this here. Now, if he was really greedy, he'd go for this check down here, but that's just exceptionally greedy. The um, So, yeah, he lost eight seconds that could have been put into the clock cycle. He's probably not reaching for that right now because of the lack of um, shield dashing. But once he starts getting to a point where he can make that cycle, then getting this eight seconds back is going to be pretty good. Yeah, the lower one's incredibly slow, absolutely. This is the best side of items you could find, and I went traded seconds out. Yeah, like there's better places to do item checks, right? Like we're like um like you're gonna go to the um, succubus room is probably the best because you can just soul steal and check five things at once. Even like um or let's look at it from this perspective. Sometimes I skip the attic checks in keep. That's eight checks over twenty seconds to give or take a little bit, right? This is one check for eight seconds. So again, he probably doesn't need to nitpick on this kind of stuff. But we'll see. Now, the bigger problem is the poisoning here. Now, interesting fact, poisoning halves your damage, but not the damage you do via spells. So, the, um, his, he shouldn't, the Slogger and Guybon fight shouldn't be that bad. But here, okay, he's doing this here. He kills the guy. Let's bring it back like a little bit. Oh, no, it goes back so far. But anyways, like he shield dashed a little bit. And then kind of took his time a little bit. Like, if you're going to do this, just shield dash the whole time. And then stop if need be. He kills it. Doesn't have the awareness to see the poison. So that's going to make this slower. That's not what I want to have happen. Yeah, he's even saying, I didn't want this to happen. But it is what it is. Yeah, double the time per item check compared to the attic. So he does have a... Um, so the good news here is with the cape, that's going to significantly cut down the time that this status effect is going to last for. And you can look at his MP bar right now too, right? <laughs> he's not regenerating that. here. Oh my so he's going to do a... He's going to do this um, Tetra Spirit and then still not get his mana back unless it ends soon. Like, he should have full here. What a nuisance. This is going up. Yeah, so we're going we're gonna to chalk this up as a mistake overall. Getting poisoned and then having to go through this fight here like the way he is... This is going to cost him a huge amount of time. Yeah, get to this way. You got to get over here. Yeah, see, he's lost a bit of time there too. You got to get over, but he stuttered a bit. That's fine. These the ones should all be one hits, but he's still poisoned, I think. He doesn't look like he's flashing anymore, though. No, it hey, is a little yeah, bit. It's kind of hard money. to tell at the end of it. He had the anti venom. Actually, you know what? Let's Maybe look at this. Hold on. That's an amazing point. He had the anti venom. And look at his MP, right? He's not going to have enough MP for the um for the marble gallery that's the that would have been a, i would have chalked that up to brilliant if he had used the um the anti i didn't even think about that but yeah it would have made his fight better because the um the shield rod hits he would have landed for more damage and then he would have had full mp for this se- or close to full mp for this section because you get with the mystic pendant you get almost all your mp back while you're doing the climb probably should slogger faster and make guy grab him yeah that was a bit of an l2 there's a I in my in the last video I did, there's a good setup for um for getting the double kill, but he wouldn't have got it here, but yeah, you gotta hit him. Yeah, I should've just skipped, yeah. But yeah, so he he's gonna be MP drained through this whole section. So I guess the takeaway here is um don't don't get poisoned. Oh my god, don't get poisoned. It, it just costs so much here. I'm gonna be mad if it is. Levels up here. Yeah. He untransformed a bit I late. Because... Yeah, okay, get the MP refill here. So now we know he's not poisoned because his MP is now going up. That's the, oh, the best way to tell. Just hit this guy here. So this Axe Knight's worth it to kill. Just wanted to offer a promotion to your viewers. You know the Doge hype? Yeah, let's go, guys. We got the Doge hype. There we go, guys. Get, get, your, get your bullshit cryptocurrencies into you. I didn't tell you to do it. So here's the thing, right? Now his timer's a bit off, but he's already missed the clock cycle according to his timer. You can't get over this axe armor. Yeah, absolutely. You gotta kill him. And with the with the shield rod doing um, blunt damage, it's a one it's a one hit. So that should have been easy. But yeah, this is not yeah. So he's he's missed the clock cycle. 
already. So I'd say the biggest time loss was like just the, the poisoning was what hit him the most. <laughs> Do you skip creature? <laughs> Fortunately, everyone needs a task. Oh, what do you mean by the task? I may have missed that here. Oh, wait, you mean task can oh, to get over the um, axe armor. Yeah, 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 we're not a task, that's for sure. So we've lost a good amount of time here already. The poisoning was probably the biggest deal. Okay, now what is he? He's going to the menu. The good news here is he actually did recover like half his MP. And he's going to recover a lot of it going down here. So he may have actually got away with one with the MP. Because he never bottomed out. So I may have been wrong with that. Okay, a little bit of jewels up there. I don't mind taking a look at that. Usually I don't look, and I'll just look at this one. Yo, oh, well now it's worth it. So we're going to say he did a good move there. He looked at the gem. He got it early. And that's going to work out for him. Now, if this ends up being a library card... Oh, he, mi oh, he missed Honestly, the uh, thing. The anti-venom down there, yeah. or the uncurse, whatever one it was. I would have picked it up. Like I having sources of iframes is really good, because especially because he's missed the cycle. Beat. Like taking three seconds to get go at that, I think is worth. I believe we got the same. Base. But he didn't. Wait, whoa, 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 Shut the front door. Wait, hold on. He peeked the item. He saw the aquamarine, and he didn't get the aquamarine. Like, that would have solved it, hit any shot. I mean, he's got... Actually, we should do this. Hold on. I need to make sure my other thing's up here. So, level one, we've got gravity boots. 50 keys going to catch those DD. <laughs> yeah, it's not a blunder yet. There's no blunder yet. But, so, to me... So... The the eight hundred dollars isn't as big of a deal as it would have been if he didn't have gravity boots here, because he can be fairly certain that the shop relic isn't progression. But it could be a Vlad, it could be the Rando ring, it could be something else. Like this is definitely a mistake. Or maybe it's a blunder. I don't know, we don't know yet. Yeah, you can just go to All Rocks too. The um but we don't know where he's going to decide to go, and it, even if he has access to it with the clock cycle. Well, actually, now he's in the six-minute range. Again, his thing's a bit fast, but it should be open for him. I'm going to chalk it up to a mistake. He, he should have grabbed the... Uh, he should have definitely grabbed the Aquamarine. I think that's worth it this period of time. All right, let's keep her going here. As long as we're all in this together. It'll be, we'll upgrade to a Blunder if he doesn't have enough money, and it's something important. Okay, so this is fine. So this should be open. He should be going up here. So he hasn't really had to make any decisions yet. He's just going with the flow, which is fine. Oh, wait, but this is... Well, no, he didn't need to do that. It stays the whole time. Yeah, keep her going. No, 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 just... Hey, diagonal. Oh, he's having the problem with the diagonal. What's going on? No, no, no. Okay, if he gets into the ceiling... Yeah, that's so... Yeah, so hold on a second. So the reason why that didn't work before is because he didn't have air control out of the doggo and you only he only got it back because when he untransformed he was against the ceiling and it regains your um your air control so just when 50 watches this back when he says like why did that happen he just you you won't get air control out of a um a gravity jump um from a transformation okay let's see what we get over here a card at a logic does pick it up i guess that's fine i know a lot of the guys like trying to get to for for fairy card or the sprite. Okay, well now we have money, so he's made up for the one mistake for um, for that, and he's gonna he's gonna go up here. Yeah, as you said, exactly. So we can we can remove the mistake. He actually ended up doing good there. He didn't need it. So he's gonna go here, and I think this is fine. Like you can. You definitely want to go up here and lichen when you've got um, what you call it. When you've got um, leapstone, because the next form of progression is likely either here or at keep, and you can hard go to keep. In this situation, like this is in logic for sure, it's going to give him a bunch of item checks, which this I'm sure he's going to go for it now. And like these are fine. Practice. Like this is going to take a bit more time. He's going to get a potential of three of them here. Like I think that's worth. Alucard shield. There we go. Yo, this is what we're going to say here. This is a positive yeah, drop for sure. Whatever. This is positive drop circumstance. So he's done really well there. Alucard shield significantly increases his... Um, 
Yeah, exactly. It's even more worth with full wolf. No, I'm just gonna reset the room. Yeah, it's fine. Blunders a bit with that, but that's okay. I mean, just me like general blunder, not not like actual blunder. Yeah, like you could. What I think, Matthias, is with um with wolf there. Like I think, like you you try to stop before you um you get the items. Yeah, hit him with there. You go. Okay, so he's gonna get flight here. Fantastic. Wait, what is he going? Is he gonna leave this behind? Oh, I guess you don't need it. How do I feel about this? That's interesting. So, we need to put this here still. So we know that level two gave us flight. Yeah, you like it, Matthias. Okay, let's just let me. I haven't considered this before. Let me just think about this for a second. How likely is Bat in this? Very. So Bat's more likely in Lycanthrope because the game's not trying to keep away a transformation from you. It's trying to because um, you already have a wolf, right? So usually in safe, it's trying to hold back the transformations because then it can add another layer of complexity to it. And it doesn't have to do it in this one, right? So early bat is is much more likely in um, in lycanthrope. The um, and then it just holds echo from you. It holds one or the other usually. The um, so I don't know. You're probably right. This is probably a good move. Like maybe it's good to excellent because like how much time? Would, yeah, it's going to be forty to fifty seconds on this fight. His strength is low. Will you be able to save those? Which one of those? With the dive kick bats. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I'm not sure if he, if he does the, the bat kick into the dive. Or the, yeah, the dive bats. Yeah, and he can always come back here if he wants it later with mist. Like, I don't think this is a terrible... Like, I don't think it's a bad decision. Like, this, this feels fine. And I don't know what 50's um, comfort level is with the fight. So if anything, he's potentially avoiding mistakes and dying to these guys, right? I want to say this is an excellent move in context. Yeah, good to excellent. I don't think it's brilliant. And like brilliant's going to be very, very extremely rare. I just kind of put up there for reasons, but I don't think we're going to see much brilliant. But I think, yeah, we're going to chalk this up for 50 keys. I think this is an excellent play. This is him saying, I'm not going to make up the time. I'm like, he, he hasn't run any categories, so I'm not sure how comfortable he is with the normal fight. He could get through it with the attack potion or the power of sire for sure, but then he's burning through his resources. Hey, Eldris, man, how you doing? So, you, yeah, I think this is, a, yeah, this is an excellent move, we're going to say. He, he, as long as he knows where this was. Yo, yo, yak. If you want to see some brilliant, I'll send you some my runs. Yeah, man, send it over. I'm, I'm happy to review them. I'm, I want to review some good runs, too. I want to show people what a good one is. Me skipping library with bat is brilliant. Absolutely. Yeah, you can skip library if you've got bat. Absolutely. You come back with mist. Especially in um, in seeds with complexity. It's a little less good with um, casual. Deserve to die there. So now, I think the best move here is he needs to go and fight all rocks now. He's got Alucard shield. Like, this is literally free. Like, fighting is going to be no problem. Actually, maybe that kind of takes away from his... Because he could have just used the shield... Yeah, grab this. This is good. We're going to chalk this up as a good move. He needs to come back here later with the rings and having the the awareness. Wait, hold on. He's leaving? Hold on. Why are you leaving? All rocks is the next piece in logic. I don't know if I like this here. Hold on a second. So let's let's consider this for a moment. So all rocks is 100% in logic. He's got flight and you start with the default. Is he opening the shortcut? He doesn't need to. If he's going here just to open the shortcut and leave, then this is a mistake. The um, it's a it's it's like a a twenty second mistake. Yeah, it's true. So you're right. So the 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 play is I'm gonna get missed, but then he also needs jewel of open too. Like I like the idea of going up there and just getting silver ring, um, with the whole thing. See, so yeah, maybe this isn't as terrible. If he does get missed, yeah, it's unlikely to get all the pieces. Having full wolf, yeah, I think I'd finish Ulrox too. Like, if he's just going for entrance now, like, entrance is a flight check. 
and um, and then the the lab is is uh, is boots checks, and he's already done that level. And I mean, he could find some on the same complexity level now, because there's more of that opportunity now than there would have been at the beginning of the game. Yeah, this feels like a do like something to do later. So, well, let's just see how this plays out. Is he gonna first of all? Is he just opening the? If he's just opening this, this is a this is a big mistake. No, he's not doing that. Okay, good. So he's probably doing entrance. Entrance is in logic for him. Oh wait, this is a problem. He doesn't need to save here. And doing the shield spell before doesn't help either. I don't think this... Now guys, correct me if I'm wrong. I don't think the shield spell is saved. Oh, you don't need this because in Lycanthrope it's faster just to go back and forth because you have so much speed. The um, Generally, it's a very good move to save split here. But... um. Yeah, you know you do have the mana. No, you got you got enough because in Lycan, um, your the the mana cost is reduced. If this was a normal seed, you're one hundred percent right. You wouldn't have the mana, but um, but yeah, you only it only takes one MP to to go through a guy, and Wolf doesn't have any um, upkeep in terms of um, like like just being in Wolf. But I can't remember if that's in vanilla or not. Yeah, exactly. You didn't know about the mana cost, so that's fine. So let's say here, um. This save here, I'm going to say right now this is an inaccuracy. If he takes this save split, it's upgraded to a mistake because it's going to take him more time. The um, But yeah, the, the better thing is just to go with Wolf. This is in logic just as much as Aurochs would be. Wolf is mana for second vanilla, but it... Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, Wolf is mana for second. For, sorry, I misread it. Okay, so yeah, exactly. Even more in vanilla, this would be it would be bad just to go. You wouldn't have enough MP, but because uh, like even just the um, the bloody zombies would just tick off five a time, right? And his M, we know his MP is lower by five because he missed the cross. And the damage is five exactly, and it's one here. Yeah, so Lycan's got a bunch of um, idiosyncrasies to it. Good ones, of course. Like I, I do like that Doggo gets his day. But yeah, this this one here is an inaccuracy. We might end up in it being a mistake just for the save alone, let alone this play. I kind of feel that Aurox is free. Oh wait, is he not doing entrance? Wait, hold on. Wait, shut the front door here. Now this is a mis. And then why did he save? The, you know, we gotta. This isn't an accuracy. This is actually this is kind of a blunder. Yeah, this is a blunder. Yeah, this is totally a blunder. So he's le so he. I think like while you're at Aurochs, doing that is good. You're right. Like there is like a, a like a 200 IQ move. If he ends up getting Jewel and Mist, I can come back and do him later. That would be very key. But like the likelihood isn't there. Yeah, Blunder if it doesn't pay off. Yeah. If well, you know what I'd say though. What we would do. That's why I got this category here. This is positive drop in circumstance. So like the positive drop was the yellow card shield. The um. Well, I guess like. It's still a good circumstance. He did sound good there. Or maybe I shouldn't do that. Yeah, that's the wrong categorization. We're just going to say it's excellent he got the yellow card shield. That ended up being a very good decision of his. But um, if he was to like just like somehow get missed in the in the lab, which isn't likely given that he already has sun at level 2, then we would put that as positive circumstance. So like it's a blunder in general, but like circumstances worked out for him. Like there's no like logical reason for him to do this outside of like just getting lucky here. The, um, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I don't, yeah, so, like, he warped over here, and he's going to have to warp back again, or he's going to do it for the caverns, which is even slower, especially in Lycan. Like, in safe, you can make an argument for it, but I don't think in Lycan. Yeah, so, like, this was just a portison. Just, I think the better, the best play was probably go to, um, go to, you could do the whole loop around, right? You could do all rocks, loop it, you're opening the shortcut for later if you need it, um, like the the shortcut into chapel, which could be used, but not really. But I mean, if you're going to go that way anyways, you're going to for free. And then um, just go to keep and get all those flight checks as well. And they're all at the same logic level. Where now everything in the lab could have been done with just the um, with just the gravity boots. So he's doing checks at a level he's already exceeded. It doesn't mean he won't get stuff here. But like the odds are better that he'll get progression in higher levels at this point. Okay, so let's keep her going here.
And then, yeah, like, why make the save if um, if you're not going to do it? Unless he changes his mind. Yeah, exactly. Like, he may have to go back up again. That could have been an angled jump, but that's fine. Okay, use the iframes to get through the spikes. I like it. He, and this is the other thing, too. So now, because he's using the aloe card shield, where he doesn't need to fight any bosses, now he's not shield dashing because he's trying to preserve his MP. I'm gonna say it's an inaccuracy. I think just I think there's an there's an inaccuracy in using Elo card shield where he did. Yeah, he's he's gonna objectively lose time because of it until he gets to a boss. So he could have done it later. I'm just asking for us to start with Maldon. Let's be real. Or you know, if we could just keep Elo card shield. Yeah, exactly. But yeah, he walks a lot in general. But I think he's doing it now on purpose. Yeah, it would be that. Yeah, exactly. He has another shield. You could dual wield the shields. That that would have been a good play. He doesn't. He didn't need to make the play when he did it. But that would have been a better play for sure. He could have just double jumped through this whole thing here. But like, I'm not gonna like, I'm not gonna like give him anything for that. Like, 50s, um, still learning a bunch of stuff. So like, like. Heavy movement optimizations, we don't need to worry about as much. Dang it, why did I do that so slow? Whatever. It's fine. Okay, yeah, so he gets heart. That's good. So, heart was on... Whoops, I'm doing the wrong thing here. Heart was on level 2. We'll put it over the side here. It's not going to impact our decision making, but we've got it. Yeah. Well, at least not yet. Like, if he starts getting 4... Like, here he needs to be doing, like, just, like, dude jumps upwards here. Wait, what is this? Wait, what is this? He's going to take this route down? And he's going to take the elevator. This is a mistake. So he did the lab, and now he's probably going to go back for entrance. And maybe that's why he did the save split. So wait, hold on. We need to reevaluate here, because now we understand what he was doing here. This doesn't make a lot of sense to me, but let's... Yeah, the save split. But he, he can't split now because he got hurt. So I guess his idea was, I'm going to do the lab loop, and then I'm going to go back down, and then I'm going to do entrance. And he made the save, so that if they were both nothing, he'd take the save back. And then maybe he does entrance using the same split, if he was going to use a split for that. I Yeah, so we don't know yet. So... I'm not going to add anything um, to here yet because, like, I don't know if, it, like, if he goes back to entrance, I don't think it's a blunder before, but, like, I'd say, like, it's just one big mistake. Because he's going to do everything, but it's very, um, it's very slow to do. Especially because, like, the next level could be bat, like, for sure. Like, bat, the, or sorry, let's think about this for a second. So, 50 has flight. Theoretically, I mean, he he skipped on Leapstone, but like he, like in terms of the logic chain, he has flight, right? And he already has a transformation. Bat can be anywhere now, especially on levels past two. So now he needs to be prioritizing those levels in case he does get it is an early bat seed. Okay, so let's we'll leave the blunder here for a moment. Let's see if he goes to entrance. If he goes to entrance, I'm going to downgrade it to a mistake. Oh wait, what's this? Is this going to be a positive circumstance? No. Er Meal ticket, gross. But yeah, losing like the elevator is like it's faster to go down the elevator. I get, but like this whole route overall is slow, and now we can't shield dash, so we're losing some time. Now he is a little bit. Oh, don't go! Why are you killing that guy? You don't need to kill him. You okay there? Oh, is he leaving? Hold on. Okay, so yeah, we, now we know. So, so the blunder has to stay, and we need to add a mistake. The the going through the lab and coming back like that feels just bad. And now he's leaving entrance behind. And entrance is so fast in Lycanthrope. I kind of get how like some people will skip it in safe, but um, if you were gonna skip it, like now is not the time. You haven't got anything with flight yet. Like that's so that's a good check. So the, the one, the skipping entrance is the blunder. And then warping over here just to do the all rocks checks, which he already has on that level, that, that's a mistake. And then the whole route through it. The, um, like what you want to do is 
like he's going to get jewel of open at some point right like do the lab loop and then use that to go to the to the bottom or hopefully you get both the rings or something like that the um so yeah that's 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 problematic and then all these warp transitions and stuff like that. And he's going to have to, like, if he remembers, he's going to have to warp back here again. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Of the three checks he skipped, he skipped the worst one. So he's coming back here. Now he's going to do this. Yeah, probably. So, like, the odds of him getting yeah, missed no on level two oh, wasn't so likely. Sorry. Oh, now, yeah, you got to do the angle jumps here. So, yeah, he just doesn't. He's yeah, he already untransformed in the air. Closer to the ceiling though. Come on. Yeah, now he's got it. He's on the ceiling. Now he's gonna get it. So that's a thing to work on for sure. Work on angled um, gravity jumps while you're in the air. Potion. I would have taken the potion for sure. Iframes. Yeah, skipping the checks. Yeah, actually, let's do that here. It was good to skip the checks. Like, we want him to do that. He should be rewarded for that. Yeah, he may not know how, and that's fine. That's why we're not chalking it up on the list over here. And that's okay. If he doesn't know, that's, there was no shame in that. Yo, ice cream? Is he missing the ice cream? That's a blunder. Yeah, I could understand him not using wolf there, though, if he's not confident. Because if you fall, you lose so much time. So I'm not going to fault him for that. Again, if it was Matthias, then I would, for sure. Like, he has bigger, bigger fish to fry. But this is going to be great. Fights all rocks with the yellow card shield. That saves some time. But like he could have used the shield in this no, room no, here. Feels like no. I do appreciate that he put the shield on in a room without music because then he saved like a couple frames. But we're not going to chalk up to anything else. At least not on the board here. This doesn't get rewarded here, but this is fine. This this was the place to go. Sword card is just the same amount of logic. Jumping here is a mistake. At least a mistake. Once you jump like that, you lose all your momentum. And he's going to watch this. He's going to skip the ice cream. Guys, you can't skip the ice cream. You scream. We all scream for ice cream. Got to get it. You can wolf through here too. Nice. Yeah, the biggest blunder. Next thing is he'd be skipping corn dogs. Yeah, and then like we're yeah we're losing like seconds every time. What I mean, like he probably lost a second there just from the shield dashing. He's lost a whole bunch of them. Okay, tromboner. So let's chalk that up to level three here. So he's got two. Whoops, that's the ring. We got to get the right relic. Sorry, it's very tiny for me. I've got it on a quarter of a screen. That's brilliant. <laughs> Skipping the corn dogs is brilliant. Uh, yeah, that's the wrong stream for that. I don't know what I would say would be the um the equivalent for me. What would be brilliant to skip from a food item perspective? I don't even know. Maybe in like safe when you get some of those um really dirty um, looking food things. Skipping the items up here. So this is what we mean. Hold on a second. So now to be fair, he has Alucard shield now. So I think it's a good move for him to skip the items. And I'm actually going to like chalk it up. Like he doesn't need the above items. He doesn't need items anymore. So let's just do this here. Oh, that's still not going to work. Usually I can cycle my camera and it'll stop being blurry, but yeah, exactly same thing. I can just go into here and fix that. I've got some drivers that are conflicting with each other, but anyways, the um, so he's got Alucard shield, but this is what we mean by like he could have taken the same amount of time, and that he did at the IQ check and got three things. So that's why usually IQ check is bad. He doesn't need to jump here. Either. Like, I know some people jump to save MP, but you don't need that because, oh, this is going to... Okay, there you got it. Because the wolf ticks down so low, like, the, it's just the time you're spending in the air, you maintain your acceleration, but you don't accelerate further. Yep, so he's going to just mean, cruise through this guy. Too, and, uh, yeah, my, a lot of my stuff is bad. Oh, no, he's self-aware. The eye tracking feature? Oh, no. Or eye contact? Oh, yeah, because it keeps you looking at the camera, right? No matter what. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Here we go. He doesn't jump there. That's fine. Doesn't need the MP here. Because he can get, he's got enough to get across over here. This is fine. And the other thing, too, is it's not only that he's not, ba well, he's not, when he does backdash, like he loses one MP and then he loses the regen, which he's getting at twice the rate. 
All right, nothing there. That's fine. I should have checked that. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Get the warp. Get the warp. Okay, Come good. On. Okay. Come on, <laughs> Yo, wait. Get the warp. <laughs> Yo, get the warp. Get in there. Get the warp. Okay, here we go. Yeah, just leave it there. We're not warping out of here. We don't have the other wall or anything. That was scary. So these are all going to be... These are these should be money checks. I mean, we saw one... Every time. But, like... And, like, maybe it's that fire of bat what he needs to do next. But at the very least, like, this should be good. All right, a bit of sloppy here. There is good wolf moving in Duth here. And, um... Fire1520, in his initial video he did on Lycanthrope, walks through how you can get through this section. Yo, Cal. Hope you're doing well, man. I saw you were playing Breath of Fire, um, right? I didn't see which one from the notification. Yeah. But hopefully it went well. I played the shit out of Breath of Fire 3. Yeah, so there's none here. So he's gonna get... Oh no, he didn't get hit. You can start the wolf earlier. Oh no, he's not gonna be able to get to peek this because he's having so much trouble with the, the wolf here. Yeah, I can't either. So that's fine. But it just... to. But the thing is, you gotta be aware that if you can't do the... Oh, okay cube that doesn't matter yeah don't go get cube don't do it that's not really information i don't think the cube's a lot of information right now because yeah. you just yeah. said information and i'm i'm really having oh number four very cool moving left or right after gravity jumping lately. okay he's also self-aware of that it's because he doesn't have if he had the leap stone he wouldn't have this problem um, so so you know what i almost think that transform Oh, he's going to get schooled now. Here we go. Relevant to if nice. Delic to Delicious is giving it to him. Gravity jumping, you can't drift afterwards. You have to do a dra diagonal to go left and right. I didn't know that. Oh, so 50 yeah, didn't know that. That's that fine. Reason, We're not going to hold that against really, him. Like, he picks up gla gas right. cloud. Gas cloud is fine. I don't have it in my list of things here because it doesn't you know up progression. Place? But yeah, so he... Yeah. He, I mean, he, he can do like the diagonal drift. He knows that fire of bat like, is... It'll happen a lot where it's like... You get fire of bat or entrance, light light actually. actually. I think those are the last like pure flight checks he has no, available. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll uh, follow up in, in place. That's why. This was a thing I learned. I yeah, he's losing that. so much time for the, the shield dashing. And like to be fair, like I'm not I sure how good a shield dash like is, but... I mentioned it in a video recently, actually. Um... Well, the thing is that, oh yeah, you don't need the attack potion now. He doesn't need the attack. Uh, you normally you would. So no, because the the thing I'm using only tracks progression items. Yeah, but like specifically knowing it happens. Yeah, one's gonna be jewel holy glasses. If it's missed, then that would have been the Diagon play. He skips the one thing there though. I think that's an like, if you're gonna check items, and maybe he's not because of the yellow card shield. Like you want to check that item. Because I mean, I of the possibility I mean, for the library card or the really mana prism, I think it's worth to stop there. With, with any of the other I'm gonna say it's an inaccuracy. We don't know how. I mean, maybe. Oh, we're missed. Well, this is a, a, a mess. Yeah. It's a lot of mana, though. Not yeah. really. I mean, no, even if you want, yo, this shield going away. That's funny. To like avoid having to do the bullshit mist. Right, like mis misplayed is awful. Cane stone here, yeah, that's an excellent move. Okay, he doesn't need this stuff here. Oh, he grabs this aquamarine, yeah, but not the last I one. Just hate because it consumes a lot of. Things. See, now he's checking items over here, okay, which is which is fine. Like but he didn't check the the item that was like guaranteed to be a, a sellable, or no, not sellable. A um. Warlock is actually not that bad. I think he's gonna bonk up no. here. I can tell you that right I now. Mean, it's cool. It just the... yeah. So here's the deal. When he gets back down to the bottom here, all right. Oh, yeah. Um, you see these um. These windows here. If you're in between these windows, you will not bonk. The um, now he's going to have some problem because the diagonal is giving a bit of an issue. But um, any time in um, in these seeds, if you if you need to go straight up to get fire of bat, and you're in between these, you won't bonk, and you'll be in the perfect position to to move over. Oh, he didn't. He doesn't. He didn't understand that he didn't have um, air control when he's in wolf, and one of the players just told him that. So he, he either doesn't know how to do it, or, or if he doesn't do it up here, he just doesn't know how. Or he was just un, unaware of how air controlled works out of gravity jumps out of logic with... Um... Yeah, you can still do them. But he, I think he was confused, like, why am I not moving over? Like, he thinks it's broken, right? But yeah, you're right. He can totally do them. Okay, so this is... Yeah. Well, he can do it like that. That's also Honestly, fine. it's like... 
I feel like so now Olaf you got to, okay now he's gonna get more enjoyable because he's on the ceiling okay the type of person who okay here's holy glasses a flight left so playing the holy glasses it, you know <laughs> so I don't think you want to go to second castle yeah. right away and I'm gonna sh I'm gonna talk about why in a moment just let me um let me put those here okay so we're at wait no that's level three what am I doing here not level four am I, am I drunk here what am I what am I out of my mind there we go more people need to use the double shield method. Yeah. Well, the, or the thing is, like, yeah. So do you check library or go to warp and go to second castle? So it's a great question. So right now, right, I'd say the biggest thing he doesn't know is um, generally at this point, when you've got flight and stuff like that, you'll probably get at least one relic that is on the same or one progression relic or item that's on the same level as everything else or as one other thing. So, and that can happen three times. They provide that mist isn't flight and it's four times the, um, or potentially there's four items. The, um, so if he goes to second castle, he doesn't know what he's looking for or when to go back. That's the only problem. If he gets in, if he gets jewel of open, it's fine. But like jewel of open could just like easily be an entrance right now. I don't think that, like, and if he goes to the library, it's fine. But, like, if you're going to skip anything, I think skipping library is comfortable. The, um, because that was in logic with, um, Boots. So, Boots opened up, um, Coliseum, um, the Fairy Scroll, and the Lab Checks, right? The, um, and one of those, I mean, hit, obviously, because that's where they, we got the other thing. So, there's only one more. There's more things in the second castle. It's it's possible. I'm not going to dock him for going to the library, but if he w is going to skip anything, I can understand skipping library. The the entrance is still a blunder. He could, f like, and it would be good information if he found something in, in the library because then he'd know, like, it's the seed's going to be more linear. Like, going to the stop display on Alucard Shield, it's possible for a library card and all the info for the three. Yeah, exactly. Like, if he does get a library card, that'd be fantastic. But, um... Like, you would feel bad to just get, if you just got Vlad's, oh, that's the thing. Like, if he gets four Vlad, if he gets two Vlad's there and he goes into the second castle with four Vlad's, that's amazing information. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll keep her going here. We'll, we'll, we'll hold we judgment until we like see what's going on. Just because it was the weekly seed just to practice Warlock stuff. And he did, like, the freaking mist rise on every check he could. Yeah, like... I was just like, oh, we're at entrance at the start of the game. I'm mist rising. I'm checking the relic. Oh, you definitely mist rising, That's Warlock. Actually, we, we did the math on that. That one makes a lot of sense. Yeah, so he don't need yeah. to grab this I mean, right he, now. If you're mashing as well. Unless he's leaving right now, which would be a blunder. Is not good. So the reason he doesn't need to do this, and it's, it's force of habit, is usually we do this immediately because we've come to the outer wall from the bottom, so the elevator is not at the top. And so the door will be locked, right? For which which holds the relic. But because he came from the top, the elevator is already at the top. So once he activated the elevator, then um, he didn't need to go into here to get the elevator to come back to the top to do both at once. So yeah, I think this is an inaccuracy. That's that's fair. But to be fair, he may not know about it. But like, it's good to note it. It's an inaccuracy for sure. The um. You definitely check that he's good for in a second. Yeah, no, it's fair. I think that's a, that's not a bad call. He has money too. I think he got like the Onyx or something. So he's he's got a fair amount of money to get um, use items. So let's keep this going here. So he could have just went to the relic, gone to the library if that's what he's going to do. pretty rough, and then I think. Okay, nothing here. That's fine. So yeah, he is going to go to the library. The turquoise. Yeah, the turquoise is good enough. Yeah. At least gravity boots has like the ledge halfway. Yeah. You know. Yeah, if you get jewel. Then, True. then yeah, you'd want to stay, I think. Or maybe not, but at least you'd know that, like, you'd get access to out of logic mm -hmm. checks right away. If you were then, to get, like, like Spike Breaker or something. To make it less awful, you would have to give Power of Mist, but then This is fine, he's not sure of the movement really here, that's fine, though. Like, things. jumping up immediately there is kind of bad, too. Well, that just I, I gives get... you flight anyways. Yeah. And spike breaker at a logic. yeah, use the Alucard shield. That's good because the, yeah. the stick's not going to bonk them in one go. Plus, Nothing here. Swinging a miss on, on two of the things here. There's Although, like, he was definitely going to get outer wall. Hello? Why am I doing that? That's true. That's true. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. So. Oh, no, you don't need to do this. You're going to get hit. Oh, yeah. Just go do it from the ground. 
Oh, but now he's gonna. Oh, now he's gonna. Get, don't get poisoned. Yeah, this is a problem. A way to, like make it so that wasn't required. I I really think it should just. Be you know what? I almost want to take away the excellent move for leaving. Oh, okay. Like, this is this so feels great. Hold on. This that changes everything. That feels amazing. The rando ring. The rando ring is a, is fantastic. That gives you so much good information. This was actually we gotta we gotta give him a good move here. So. That would have been here, the rando ring. It doesn't increase his vulnerability count, but he does get the rando ring. So we're going to say that going to the library, is it, I don't think it's excellent, but it's definitely good. It was definitely positive he went here. That gives him a lot of good information. I didn't even think about the rando ring. The um, Can you buffer the wolf transformation from the red doors? I don't think you can. It just I think it's just the blue doors. The... Um, because I don't think you can buffer any input out of the red. I could be wrong, but I'm, I'm fairly confident it's just the blue. So, um, the rando ring is the first one you get because it can be anywhere in the ch in the chain before you get it. Um, yeah, you, you can you can. Oh, you can in. Oh, you can in a version. Okay, that's cool. So, um, so this has been. I'd say this has been worthwhile. Like getting the rando ring because if he gets another ring in the second castle, he'll he'll know its progression. The, um, and now he can probably be pretty comfortable it's not progression. And so, like, the mist thing is still an option if you find it, but it's not just, like, something you're doing every season. So let's see what we got over here. Is he going to get a library card? Is this going to be... I would prefer that. Positive circumstance here. Okay, he's got but two. I guess it's the okay, let's take this thing. slow. So Spirit Orb here. Heart refreshes for 4,000 is unfortunate. High potions for 200 are cool. I make it in every we're going down each one library card okay here we go this is a positive circumstance here he did hit on the library that's good we already gave him good for going to the library and then this is even better so that's good this is going to hopefully save him some time so i like this yeah you know we got here there's a vorpal blade there yeah it's a good alternative uh, going to the bottom i didn't see all those but just, i don't think i saw yeah, duplicator what is he gonna buy though uh, just more library cards doesn't buy any buy high potions uh, I think that's an inaccurate that he had money left over like, uh, it's an inaccuracy because he, he can get iframes I'm, I'm not for um, lie, other I things I like expedition not yeah, adventure like adventure is a little too long but I, I really like expedition so what he got here was information like uh, doing this whole thing He's going to have to do it again later anyway, so he could have left it behind. But he did get a good information with the silver ring, and the library card mitigates it. So the thing to remember with using library cards, unless like he goes back with just mist, or, let's see, I wouldn't buy anything to leave money for another card later. Oh, I see, that's fair. He did get two of them, but yeah, I could understand that. But the thing is, he has, or you know, you're right, Like if he didn't have enough money, that'd be fair. We can take that off, if that, especially if that's what he was thinking about. When you come for movement, so yeah, he couldn't buy that one, so that's fair. Uh, there's a lot of time okay, so he's going to bounce you know, now. So he's leaving behind uh, entrance. It's saying it's out of logic, but it totally like was. The second castle with, without good movement. Not even wolf. That's fair. Guys, I feel really stupid. I've just like not been following. He has an anti-venom. He does have the anti-venom for silver ring. It's comfy to have more than one thing, though. What's going on? He just, he just has the one anti-venom. I don't know if he picked up anything else. I could be wrong. I did take away the inaccuracy. Okay, so now he's going in. Second castle is no problem. This is good. Wait, where are we going? Oh, yeah. Put the holy glasses on. He could have done that in the save room to save a couple like frames or whatever. But that's fine. Jump here. Wonderful. Nice. Run in. Perfect. Yep, skip the items. I like it. Yeah, exactly. It's not an inaccuracy. No, you guys are right. Yeah. It's a weird seed. Wait, what are we doing? I'm doing fine. Okay. This is an inaccuracy, though. Uh, this is kind of luck, though. Yeah, now he's having to menu for all these things. Like, this fight should have been over a while ago. Yeah, Power of Sire is not bad. This will be good. If he's not confident with the spell use, this is fine. Over. It's still inaccurate all over. Like, the fight didn't go very well. The, um, he had to use a resource to get out of it effectively. He, he probably didn't want to hit him with the shield because, like, that's going to kill Richter. Huh. So, like, it was very resourceful of him, but he shouldn't have had to have been in that situation.
Because, like, he got the soul steal, right? Like, all he had to do was do the other spell and put it. It just seems like you kind of just stood there for a couple seconds. Okay, what are we doing here? Put the shield rod back on. That's fine. Yeah, because he has to reapply this spell. I... Maybe someday I'll buy a... Oh, he's going to suffer here. Oh, no, 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 because he just... He didn't do the out of the wolf, so that's fine. Like, if you like, so what I keep thinking about is, like, I think that leaving, also, I need to care about the delay leaving Leapstone delay behind, I think, was a good idea in general, but it's costed him a lot of time. Delay. Especially because he had the Alucard shield. Going up here first? Yeah. Is he going to left side, best side? I, uh... No, he's not going to get the... I don't think that counts as a roof. Oh no, he did get the diagonal. There we go. He did the diagonal grab jump. There it is. So he grabs the teleporter first. Now, if he feels like he's behind, he might be going left side, best side. But I think this is a mistake. Or, or actually, I'd say this is a blunder. I hate my movement. I think he's gonna go left side, best side. He feels behind. Yeah. Yeah. There's. So I don't know how I feel about this. Yeah, with not using the um, that's the thing with without using the diagonal grab jumps we had. Oh wait, here's Jewel of Open. Wait, hold on. No, you go back now. Yeah, go back now. I think you go back now. Hold on. I mean... Yeah, I think you're right with all the bonks. You know what I want to do? I'm going to take away the excellent one. We're going to leave it neutral for now. But, um... You wouldn't... No, I know you wouldn't. I think it makes sense for someone who knows what's, what, what's going on. Oh, I wouldn't get the warp. Yeah, I wouldn't get the warp either. I think what his idea was... So let's let's think about this for that. I think the reason he got the warp is I think he was going to go through the left side of the castle, which to me is a mis like it's at least a mistake if not a blunder. It can work out for sure, but like statistically, it's a bad play, right? Get the warp then library card, yeah. After Aquadon, mm -hmm. yeah. So let's let's take a look at. There's two different things going on here. So first, getting the warp at all was a bit of a problem. Although he might be, th because like he doesn't need, he has library cards. Like he's going to be able to get back to the first castle. Like getting that warp to go back doesn't make any sense. The only thing I'm I'm thinking of Diagon though, if so, the, the other part of what he was doing. So going back down to Darkwing Bat, I think he was going to continue from Darkwing to Creature, and then that warp can be useful because if he gets all the way to Gallimoth and it's nothing, then he needs the warp to get back to go to Medusa. And that's why, like, again, like, it, 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 it loses a tempo getting that warp. And, like, when you think about it, it probably took him, like, 30 seconds, like, out of his way to go get it, especially with the jumping. Yeah, this route doesn't make any sense. Exactly. You're right. In general, with a library card, you don't need the warp. The, um, it's not even late game, so, yeah, why are you pushing for that? You may not even need to fight Aquadon because everything else can be the first castle. You shouldn't have summoned someone's too much ahead or something. Yeah. Like, there's things that, like, I think what he's trying to do is say, I'm going to gamble to make up time for the other movement stuff. But, like, he could, like his decision-making in the first castle could have made up for that instead. So, they, they would, and, would have, and, like, so he's he's snowballing bad decisions on top of bad decisions. The, um, so, yeah. And the other thing, too, is here, right? Like, um, actually, well, let's just make sure we do this first. Jewel of Open is here for so i don't think it's a bad idea so yeah so getting go thinking about doing the um like opening the warp and then thinking about doing left side was a mistake at the very least because he wasn't he didn't even do it anyways right like he got a good item so he lost a bit of tempo there like he probably lost like at least 30 seconds opening that teleporter where it was completely unnecessary in a normal sense, but like he's not even going to use it now anyways, right? So let's assess one thing before we go on. So I agree with Matthias. I think going back now makes a lot of sense, in particular because Jewel of Open opens up so many out-of-logic checks. The um, uh, potentially Silver Ring and um, 
and potentially um, spike breaker. But here's the biggest problem. And you can, so you could make an argument here to not go back right away. And so here's the problem. On none of these levels of progression has he received two progression items. The, the ring doesn't count because it's the rando ring. Yeah, exactly. You can't full clear first castle. That's what I'm going to talk about here. So, the, so we know to in order to get this progression chain to work, as long as it is in eight, eight steps, which it typically is in Lycanthrope, you have to get in a, something that grants progression on the same level you already got progression on three times. I like to call it the vulnerability count or the reverse count. But that has to happen three times. Now, I'm sure you guys can see where this is going. In what area of the game are you most likely to get at least two things on the same level of progression? We'll play like the Jeopardy music here, right? Second. Absolutely. Very good. Because everything in the second castle is on the same level of progression in Lycanthrope specifically. Because you always have Wolf, right? So... It's the most likely place. Yet yeah, you won, yo. I don't know what you've won, but you did win. So, because, and that's why I was saying before, like, when we were talking about, um, like, what checks the gravity boots open and counting up to five, like, there is a bit of vulnerability there that you'll get the same, you get signed on the same level. The, um, but it's, it's, it's drastically accentuated on the second castle. I think... Jewel and the second castle are the biggest pieces, and Jewel gets accentuated more if you get like Merman statue and all that kind of stuff. So he could miss out on a lot of things here. If he misses out on Spike Breaker, that's a missed opportunity for um, out of logic shenanigans at Spike Breaker. If he lose, if he misses out on Miss, that's a huge loss. The um, the other ring, Merman, right? Like he may have to make several trips back and forth. So right now, his vulnerability count is zero. And the seed is only linear when that becomes three. So he's really at risk here going back after this. I still don't think it's necessarily a bad move, especially because it's Jewel of Open. Like if it was, let's say he got the ring there instead, like gold ring, it would be much less worth it. But Jewel, you can make an argument for because if he ends up getting spike breaker down there then he can get stuff right like he might be able to break the chain that way but um so it's better than if he was just going back for holy glasses but it's still not great i don't know how i feel about this i don't normally like if he if if the vulnerability count was higher i would say this is a good move but it's not so uh yeah, and that's the other thing. So maybe this is why we need to say, yeah, you don't lose time. You go back after the Aquadon Warp. And actually, you know what? This is why this is actually... An, um, I'm going to say this is a mistake. So here's the biggest thing with this, right? He's trying to go left side, best side. Or at least that's that's the assumption. I could be wrong. But the assumption is he's going left side, best side, considering when he got the Warp and stuff, right? He has a fantastic opportunity to go right, get the Warp, and then Library Card fantastic opportunity which helps if he's going to go back again if he decides he's still going to go left side best side at least he's mitigated it at that point it wouldn't be great but it'd still be like better than if he just hard goes left side so that's an amazing point so this is a mistake for sure go at least to aquadon you need three more vlads and the vulnerability count is is literally zero so at the, yeah at the very least go to aquadon so yeah this is a bit of a I might stay until I got a second item that opens up progression some way. Other ring, Merman, Spike Breaker in this situation. Yeah, even if it was Echo, because at least Echo would give you knowledge. Echo's like, okay, my vulnerability count has gone up by one. Yeah, Diagon is definitely right here. So yeah, this is a mistake for sure. Now, we don't know how it's going to end up, but like on the surface, this is absolutely a mistake. If any, it, or it could even be a blunder. Is this a blunder? Is the whole thing just here a blunder? Maybe remove the two mistakes and just give him a blunder. Because he was going to go left side. The movement over there was pretty bad. He ended up not even using the warp. Now he's going to go back. Yeah, I kind of think... I think this was two before. 
Because I think it gave him a mistake for the teleporter, right? Or we'll just make this three. We're just going to put a blunder here. That's fine. You don't think he was going left, though? I think he... Well, just because I've played with him so much, I think he was going to go left. But you're right. I could be wrong. But uh, yeah, like this is... Uh, this is a problematic here. Isn't everything a 50-50? Either you're right or you're wrong. Not necessarily, because like, if it's like the same things that it is. Yeah, I just, because I know him personally. But yeah, like I can understand, like if you haven't played with him, like he has gone left by the side, by the side a bunch. And like he had done the setup for it. Okay, let's keep this going here. Again, maybe this ends up working well, but yeah, this is kind of a blunder. Or is he going to save this here? Oh, wait, maybe I was too short. I thought he was already going back here. So I don't know what the save is going to do here. You don't save for just Jewel of Open. Save card. I think he's just going back. But there's no way that this is going to be good. And like this adds to the argument that this, this entire thing is a blunder. Because the likelihood is, is that Jewel's going to have something. Yeah, you could card here. Especially with wolf movement to get um, to the outer wall, then to Marble Gallery and go that way. Oh. The library card, like it, the library card would save a bit of time here. I can understand it, but like, I don't think I don't think it's like hard required that you had to card there. Strength Ocean. Because if he goes to Outer Wall, like, when you menu for the library card, get out of the menu and go through it, like, you'd save some time, but not, like, a huge amount. I'm just going to chalk it up to the Blunder. He's got two of them. I don't know if he got any more money. Are you doing something? Like, maybe he's worried about that. I guess so. I don't know. He's going to go from here. This is fine, I guess. I don't know if it's faster from here or from Outer Wall. Are we not all getting the Iron Shield? I probably would have done it from the outer wall I just because you're closer to like the we'll the nice. switch and you get a better run I with the wolf. Even if it's physically longer, like yeah, I think it I takes a shorter amount right of time now. in Lycan. Okay, we are shield dashing now. Iron shield's okay. Well, now we're stopping because well, he's going to run out of MP. Although he should be fine here. He should be able to abuse shield dashing here because he's going to get... A refill at Succubus. This movement's fine. Like, I know it could be a bit better, but this is fine. He doesn't need to jump there, though. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Maybe they would have... I can't remember. I don't know if it would have been faster from Middle Wall. My condolences on that. It's more of a straight shot, but I don't know. You can buffer it there, but not a lot of people know about that. Another turquoise. Okay, so he's got more library card money. Yeah, it is a lot of warps, too. Although he did... It would just be entrance and then to outer wall. So, like, five seconds or something like that. Yeah, same thing, probably. Yeah, so we're not going to knock him for that. It's fine. Now, this is going to be interesting. He can get in here immediately with um, skill wolf, but he's going to do this, and hopefully... Oh, he does do the diagonal. Nice. Okay, there we go. That worked out. Nice. Oh, accidentally awesome movement. I'll take it. Accidentally awesome movement. There we go. We're going to give him a good for that. Accidentally awesome movement is fine. Yo, I skipped the Soul steel. He didn't. Oh, here we go. Yep. Oh, and the duplicate. He doesn't even. Yep. That, very good. Very. Oh, no, no. You got to get in there, though. No, that's not going to work. Oh, no. This is where. Oh, no. He got in there. That's actually a pretty tight jump. And then grab the Buffalo Star. I guess you don't need the Buffalo Star. Although, maybe because he's using up all his MP. Yeah, he's saying not now. Okay, that's fine. Duplicator's good, though. So he doesn't have to worry about his library cards anymore. Doesn't have a Mana Prism. Doesn't have Heart Refreshes. Although, I don't think he, he knows how to do that. I'd brilliant, I'd brilliant him if he used um, um, Heart Refreshes to go through the Spike Room. Yeah, exactly. Making, yeah, not equipping it makes sense. He doesn't need it right now. Unless he wanted to shield dash. But, like, going through all that would be a bit messy. So, here's Spike Breaker. So, this is important. So, he... I think he... Did he just say all man there? Hold on, hold on. 
listen for this. No. Oh, man. What? Hold on. I want to blunder his attitude there. Right, in a race situation, the dupe is in the spot you expect your opponents to find you. Yeah, absolutely. No one's no one's skipping this. They, they, it'd be a big mistake to skip this. So yeah, you're you you know that your opponents are going to get it. You may be thinking he went back earlier, so he has it sooner. But like, it doesn't it doesn't increase his game state that much. The um because he already has unlimited offense anyways, right? Yeah, he hasn't considered the spike breaker check. The um so this is actually fantastic for his strategy. Like, if the second castle just has Echo, right? Like, this is great. So, this is actually really good. So, let's look at the complexity counter here. So, we need to add Spike Breaker to level 5. Now, Spike Breaker itself... You know, I'm going to put these in the middle. These things here, they don't increase his, his level. Actually, we can put the Rando Ring on the, even the side. So, this here, this Spike Breaker, is increasing his Vulnerability Index. And now he got it where he can do things out of logic. So this is good. It makes the other ring location better too. Absolutely, yeah. Spike Breaker is fine. The, um, and it's going to tell him... Or what it actually does for him now is that he knows now that Silver Ring will never be done out of logic now. Because if he gets missed, it's in logic. And so like, if Bat's there and he's just going to skip that whole thing by just getting down to the bottom immediately, that could be pretty big. Okay, so that was actually really good that he's done that. Why did I not transform the wolf there? Whatever. Too late. Yeah, we're losing so much time on the Like between between not getting the um the leapstone, which has hurt him a lot, and the lack of shield dashing, like he's he's at least losing like a minute or two on that. Is he going to save here? Yo, hold on. This is an inaccuracy. You don't need to save here. What are we saving here for? For what? You're gonna do, you need to do Scylla now. Unless he's going to skip Scylla. Wait, what? Hold on. No. Er, no. This is not an inaccuracy. This is a mistake. And it's going to be worse if Scylla has something. Because there, there should be something else on this... Um, yeah, maybe not, but I don't know, right? Like, the thing is, like, unless he's going to come back here with Merman later, but I think skipping Scylla... Yeah, he didn't sing the Scylla song. That's the funny thing. Yo, I, I, I heard Twisted Sister yesterday. He has two checks there, and he can't do the one, but it's so quickly to do it. Oh, he's going to go and skip the other one, too. Okay. Oh, no, he's just... No, he's going to go back to the library card. He didn't need that. Add up in my brain. Yeah. And he's gonna skip holy symbol. No, he's <laughs> double duke. Okay, he is gonna go grab this. I think this is right. Like, look, he needs three Vlads. Like, there should be you know, something else on this level of progression if he's right. Like, he needs something to be here, or else it's in second castle. What he needs? Don't check the library card. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, good. This is like an it's the name of the priest. <laughs> yeah, she could have better Echo, so, yeah, like, exactly. Echo would actually be yeah, a really key good. piece here, because if he had Echo, the then like, again, you up go. your vulnerability you count, your which I don't think he's like, doing, yeah, that's what we should which is, I don't think a lot of people do that, really but awesome at least we can assess it based on the information he potentially had available to him. All right, what do we got over here? Nothing, that's fine. No, it's not a bad decision. That's a great decision. Because, like, when are you going to come back here, right? Like, for everyone who, like, thinks it's bad when they get nothing here, it's like, when were you going to come back to this if you needed it, right? Like, it's such a huge gamble. You've already gambled on Second Castle. He'll do entrance check now? Maybe. He might do entrance check now. I still think what he did before was a blunder. But, um, but you're right. He might do entrance check now. Let's make sure that's actually up and running. Okay, good. The seed has it was. introduced... Who's runner reviewing? Um, 50 keys. Already. He's asked us for a review. You don't need the God's Garb here, but I get why you'd pick it up. Okay, cool game. You definitely don't need to do this wolf here. That's that's just a waste. Yo, he has 69 HP too. 69 HP. So nice. Yeah, you know it, Fire or Fat Bat here. Yo, it's so nice. 
Okay, here we go. So he is going to check. This is good. This uh, mitigates his previous bis issue. Like, there was no reason to do the lap loop when he did. Oh, I like the slowdown there. That was nice. Oh, and it was a Vlad. See, he would have done. It would have been faster to do it from the air places, oh, especially in Lycan. Good movement is so fucking unintentional. <laughs> good movement is so fucking unintentional. My God, my man. Okay, so he's got three Vlads now. Three Vlads. You booing me for not wanting to mention no, Yeah, it is a pretty bad placement for him, yeah. I just disagree with what happened. Okay, we can, we can... I can get behind that sentiment. Yeah. Well, he could have taken... I guess he could have taken his um his save if um it was nothing. This seed is Although like I don't personally like that save split that much. Take it away. I've yeah. seen it in too many races where someone takes a safe okay, split and someone doesn't, that. and then the person who took it oh, shit. Oh, shit. loses oh, more shit. time. Oh, shit. oh yeah, don't die here, by the way. Don't don't drown in the waterfall. This is why you don't chase waterfalls you're not used to. Oh, he's going to run out of MP? Don't run out of MP. Yo, diagonal now, diagonal. Oh, no, yeah, he's got... Okay, that's not enough, though. It's not enough! Please, yes! Oh, my God, he barely did it. Yes. Okay. Yeah, that would have been. That's true. It would have you. It would have absolutely been more worth it. He shouldn't bought him out here. No, that's fine. Okay, and he has enough MP to do whatever stuff he needs. Okay. Yeah, if he got Merman there, and then immediately went back for Scylla. Yeah, absolutely, that would have worked out for him. Yeah, exactly. You got to go back now at some other point. Hey, sixty nine HP. Nice. Nice. Oh, someone else has sixty nine. Oh, here we go, man. These guys are just killing it. Are you kidding me? It's fine. Go. All right. So what is he gonna do from here now? I mean, he's got, he, he better go to Spike Breaker. Why there's so many familiars? What the hell? Speaking of familiars, only the best ones. You want to transform into wolf before the fireworks? Yeah, exactly. It causes more lag. You're absolutely right, MC. Yes, yo, 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 MT. All right, so if he's going to check Grand Flu, he should do that first. He's going to do the save here, probably. I don't think the save is really that great. If like in specific, because yeah, you can make up most of the time. And it's it's a sunk seven seconds if um if it ends up being nothing. Okay, good. I thought he was gonna go over to Spike Breaker first. It's like, yo, you don't want to safe split that one, it's the one to most likely to be sun. Yep, wolf again, perfect. Now, for those watching at home, he used his power of Sire earlier, and if he struggles with this fight, it's going to be a bad thing, because he could have just... Oh, no, he's got Alucard Shield. What am I talking about? I'm stupid. I thought he had, like, some other weapon. Yeah, exactly. I don't I don't know why. A lot of people do it. I, I usually don't in, like, Anthrope. Because by the time you reload your stuff, like you're practically already there anyways. And you're up to speed too. Like you're already running where the other person needs to get up to speed, like and then they have to like fall down the hole. Yeah, just raw dog it. Yeah, just get in there. Yeah, I feel you, bro. Okay, he's gonna take it. And then like you lose the items too, although I know he doesn't need them. I, I don't personally like it. How many of those drops? Oh my I don't know if I want to say it's an inaccuracy though. Or maybe it is. Any, uh, yeah. Like yeah. throw This one in particular would be a rough inaccuracy. One. I don't know. I actually he didn't need know. to do this. This isn't going to save him a ton of time, if any. I don't think so. So normally for bridge rake, so. is that logic? It's not. Um, like needing leap stone or flight. In liking, we can always. Oh yeah, yeah. So it is in logic in context that like yeah, like you if you have access to the. Um, to the caverns, you have access to the area below because it could be a power of wolf seed. 
and by work. Then. So that's I'm absolutely saying, right. Like, you should do it without. So doing the the bridge break doesn't saying, really like, increase if your you um didn't do out of your stuff. Tricks, the seed would be abysmal. Not really. These guys are spoiling stuff for him now. I think you'd be happier if you did out of logic checks. It would be the fair way to put it, right? Yeah. They're saying, like, you gotta skip stuff to make this seed bearable. Oh, right. So now that's good information for him. Because he skipped, like, the entire second castle. That's kind of... Right, yeah, wolf here. Wolf, 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 wolf. Wolf, 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 wolf. Uh, you're losing more MP doing the shield dashing. There we go. Yeah, you don't need this stuff. Yeah, he's right about... I want to say this is good here. Actually, this is excellent. He knows he doesn't need any of this shit. Just go. And now he's got the final Vlad. Wonderful. So he just has to find one Vlad randomly somewhere. Okay. Um... So he didn't get punished coming back here. At least not yet. Unless like there's a random Vlad behind Merman or something. Okay, a little bit late on the library card, oh, but good right. idea. Although funny enough, the um, I've I I want to do eventually a, a um a video on library cards and stuff like that. And from here, if you have full bat and mana, it's actually not worth it because you can get to the other the mines teleporter faster than you can get to like the outer wall teleporter, especially if you put menu time into it. No. Like I think I timed it. It's like no, it's like a minute and a half uh, or something. I could be wrong. I thought you said time for a second. I was like, I remember I wrote it down somewhere here. I did some timings. Because you got to get back to the. It's not just escaping the library. You got to get back to the teleporter. We're gonna have it here. Okay, I've got. Here's the page. I we'll, we'll go through it later. My writing's really small in this, so I'm not gonna be able to pay attention to both. I could be talking just smack, and it's not worth it. Or no, it is worth it, and I'm being an idiot. Um, maybe. We don't know where they are. They could be in the second castle. Like, he only got one thing there, and his vulnerability counts only one. There could be, like, Bat and Echo could be in the second castle right now, and then the rest of the seat is linear. Well, probably not both, because he wouldn't have enough... know the guy personally. No, it had to be locked behind someone else. Like, either Echo could be there, and then maybe Merman. I mean, he's probably Or Mist, or something like that. So he's leaving behind... So yeah, the only thing he's leaning by right now is Succubus. What is he? He's thinking about going back now? Wait, hold on. Uh, let's see how this goes. You can't go back now. You've made that decision. You've made your bed 50. you got to keep going with this. You don't save split and go back now. Not after that library card. <laughs> wait, is he, is he going to... No, don't, don't, don't. No, 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 no. Oh, wait. Or maybe he thinks... It might be there, and he can take this back later. That would be fine. Yeah, he has one check left. Absolutely. So yeah, so if he's okay, he's leaving. This is fine. Yeah, Scylla. So yeah, if he's saving here in case he does the second castle, yeah, which is overall stupid. But given his overall approach, right? If he he's he's mitigating with that save there, and I think that's fine. He's saying if it's at Scylla and I'm screwed, at least I can go back. Dude, I feel like I'm playing in scavenger mode. There's not any drops. Here. But even then, like, you could just go back to the library with your card, so. Isn't yeah, there's a reason why we have the Scylla song, right? No. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, no, you don't need wolf you're movement right. through here. All right, I'm just. Time for me. There. Oh, there's uh, time! Okay, GG. okay so that. Yeah, good job. That's I, don't, I can't remember what 50 keys time is in this race. I don't even think I looked at it. You know what? I didn't, so I don't even know what's going on here. There we go. I have the feeling I'm about to learn something I don't like. Yeah, so here's the thing. Like, he could have been... If he went left or right side here and immediately got rewarded with a Vlad, he could have skipped things after he got I. Like, he could have skipped um, Grand Flamoon for sure. I think wasn't anything right, yeah. I think he got... He got I at, like, what was it? Demon card? I don't even know how to do this movement. Without, okay. Oh, he doesn't know how to do this movement? Wait, why are we going down here yeah, for? He really did hit the time button with all fours. Actually, yeah, he's going to have a big problem in the next uh, room up here with just Wolf if he's not uh, as savvy with it. Yeah, skipping Leapstone was a big problem. Like, again, if you know how to do the movement, I think it's fine. 
man, but that, that Sid was but incredible. But outside of that, this is just, oh, yeah. it's this hard to... This a great scene. Oh, was he on Buffalo, Buffalo Stars now? It was, I didn't, I it must have missed wet. that. Maybe when I was wet. pulling for my buck here, but... Yeah, yeah for right now, absolutely. Here's Merman. Okay, okay so this is right. useful information. So, oh. Merman's statue is here. Actually, no, we'll just put here. So this upped his vulnerability count. Positive elo if you're making the man himself proud. And actually, when he got Spike Breaker down below, he didn't get anything else yeah, don't there worry about either. It. Probably uh, DB so will it's... take this tomorrow and just be... yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> get it to lose it all back. Oh yeah, he's talking about the um, he's this talking about the beat the record thing. Tomorrow, later this day. So he got Spike Breaker in probably take this and in the caverns and didn't get anything else. He's going to struggle with this. This is really tough movement. Yeah, we received not a jewel layer except for a Spike Breaker. So he got not actually. So that man, that everything was in the second castle for him because the game intended you to keep going. At least from a logic perspective. Oh, he used the bat pentagram too early. Oh, no, he had multiple of them. Okay, that's cool. I'm okay with the bat pentagram play there. Yeah, do it from down here. Line yourself up. Transform. Transform. Get. Were you close enough, though? No, he wasn't. Oh, this is going to be so hard. So this this jump in and of itself is hard even with Leapstone. The way you can do it with Leapstone is there's a... You'll see it on, um, yeah, on the right side when he falls down here. Oh, no, he got up. Let me just show it for a moment here. Um, so you're going to see a ledge exactly on the right here. Oh, no. There. See this ledge here? If you if you only... So, like, getting up where he needs to go is difficult. Like, that is really tough, especially without Leapstone. Like, there are ways around it. Like, if you can make it better. And like, I got the right. It's a bit of a disaster here. But um, if you had Leapstone, you can do a diagonal grounded gravity jump from here you will bonk no. here and then you just jump again because you still have your double jump and then you'll get it every time otherwise it can be really tough to get through here and i think he's going to get through this time right yeah, he's going to do it again okay he got through perfect yeah it's a tricky That's area but, but not good. oh he's just on duplicator and Bat pentagram now. Yeah. Yep, that should clip. No, oh, it didn't. So you didn't regain air control there? That's not count as a ceiling? Oh, now this is a mess. Again, I get that this is difficult, but yeah, there we go. Now he's got the timing. I yeah, it's it's really a big thing. Like, when we started playing safe for um, in, like, season two, a lot of people sure. had trouble with that. So, like, that's fine. I'm not going to dock him for anything like that. Uh oh, he'll fall down the hall. We've all been there. Yeah, that pentagram's not good here. Oh god. Oh, he's gonna die now too. He's gonna die. Yeah, you can just like wolf oh, through it or that. something. That's bad. Oh, did he not have the potions? Oh no, now he's gonna turn on the fairy card. No, it's not that you suck. It's just like it's it is legit hard. I remember um, Talit got it um, once on second try, and I remember him saying like back. And this is like way back in the day, years ago. He's just like, "Yo, that was actually really difficult." Yeah, just no. He doesn't have it activated though. But you're right. He could just put it on, and then he's set up for um. Yeah, actually, you're right. This should have been Alucard Shield because he could just turn it back on and fight Buddy with it. Unless he's really concerned about his MP, but then it's less concerning now that his MP pool is bigger. Yo, get those eggs and ham into you. Um, yeah, you got a wolf later. Yeah, now it's a mess. You got put out of it. Yo, just get those eggs. Yo, his cholesterol is through the roof right now. Practicing jank second castle movement should be a priority. Absolutely, yeah. Run a bunch of safe seeds. Absolutely, yeah. Safe gets you through a lot of things. Almost made it through. That's fine, though. I'm not sure of a good setup there. I'm sure there would exist, but... 
But yeah, no, I think like so. MT he left um, um, Leapstone behind in. Um, oh yeah, now he's using it, and like he could have, now hold on, he can grab you from this. Okay, you got it. I've been grabbed out of that before. If you if you don't um, if he like command grabs you right away, you can get tossed. Like literally, I'll put on a um, a potion to get iframes, so he doesn't grab me, so then I can use the Alucard shield to get iframes. Oh, okay, yeah. So now he really should have stayed, right? So now we're here. So he skipped. Oh, yeah. Now people are calling time. So he had to stay. You would fucking murder this one. How deep did you go, Fifty? I, I just know. Uh, I don't know how to push. I mean, it. If you guys are still racing here, I, I'll just pull up the. No, because there might be other people still racing. I'm not yeah, sure how many people are in this how, race. Uh, how far on some people? Yeah, don't even worry about the other people right now, Fifty. Just, just full gas here. I mean, I'm still searching for a Vlad. Okay. What I will say is this. Um, I think it is last night's race. Um, because he asked me to give it a review. Vlad, I should have grabbed. Luke. And I want to do it soon, just so that you didn't lose it. Yeah, I'm seeing here. Uh, so you just. I don't know. I don't think checking Merman's a mistake, though. Like, I think Merman makes sense. Less. Like, and I think like I the Merman statue, like, like where it actually is located. I think that's fine. But yeah, he needed no, to stay. I... I think he was trying to consider okay, second okay, castle. I'll ask our sec or left side, and that created problems right. for him. Then he left too early because he could have skipped at least Grand Falloon. Like logically, you could have skipped that. And then down. actually, because he got a here. Hold on. After Jewel of this just leans in to his entrance blunder, right? So if you take both of those blunders together, right? If he came back to second castle with tooth. And the entrance, he would have had four. He could have skipped. Um, well, he would needed still sun to get down to the bottom. But after Succubus, he could have skipped everything. And said, I'm going hard down right now. And that would have been fine. He, he could have saved so much time on this. But yeah, he wouldn't have had to check Merman. He wouldn't have had to check um, Merman, Grand Falloon, Demon Card. Although you'd probably take a peek at Demon Card in case it's bad. But at least those three checks he wouldn't have had to do. And that would have saved him a couple minutes. We'll see where he ends up in this race. Yeah. Love open, like, immediately. I just did yeah, like, like checking, like, the Holy yeah, J location with the Merman. I, I mean, think that makes sense, because that could be bad like, as well. Especially because... Uh, well, if, if he had Echo, just... then especially in that case. Yeah, so that... If you are actually following the logic, I think Bat was at Silver Ring and Mist was. Oh, these guys are spoiling castle. things. Because you uh, needed yeah. Bat to get a uh, Spike Breaker check, which was the last I line relic. I think Mist was actually at uh, Holy Glasses. Oh, this is a problem here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that, that would make sense too. And like a ring in the center. And it's only going to be harder in this one up here. You know what? Uh, I removed oh his excellent, God. I think, for I'm, skipping I'm the thing. Thinking... I'm thinking by my statue was a base. I'm giving him a blunt. The, yeah, the other blunder uh, is not grabbing the Leapstone. The ring was just in the not having the self awareness. Because look at like look at this mess here. Or Merman statue was the ring. It was one of the two. Okay, come on, don't die here. There he goes. It was really good in principle. It just it didn't work out for him. I like never actually died. Yeah, there, but that's like, the thing he needs to work on too. Yeah, more like, more um more shield dashing. Gravity boots well, movement. You spike breaker, so you're fine. Second yeah, castle so decision making. The spot I was talking about. Oh, sorry. Yeah, absolutely. Like Mitzi, I'd love to. Yeah, like maybe we can even do it right now. Streams at once. No, no, I think. Uh, I, I yeah, think not having the skill to allow the skip to be worth. Yeah, knowing that, especially with the Allo card shield. Like, I think you could so forgive him if he just had his fist going into, into that point. fight. I get it, right? Oh, that was the item I skipped was the Onyx, but I had. More than a thousand for the one library card. Okay, yeah, yeah. DM me the link. I, I, just, like, I just skipped the Vorpal Blade. I didn't now, I see you have Prime, so I know your videos are going to last a bit longer. I wasn't sure on 50, so I made sure I did it right, right, right away. I need no review. I know enough to know when I'm sucking. It's torture. That's cool. I'm just offering it up to anyone who wants it. I think I, I enjoy doing these. People seem to get value out of them. And I didn't have issues. I haven't been using the duplicator. I should bring my mic lower here. It almost killed me. Topping out here. What am I doing in my life? Just yelling into this thing because I'm a madman. 
Where did I find what? Mana Prism. Oh, Mana Prism? Was yeah, yeah, Barkeep. Right yeah, man. Do you want to... Or just, yeah, like do a, a seed in general and, and um, just stream it. Oh, with, like, the man. I didn't take yeah, this that. Is... I didn't take that. Oh, did you, did you get... Yeah, okay. it? Oh, oh it's so close. Oh, no. Yeah. So those were the three blunders, right? Man. It was not grabbing Leapstone, not checking Entrance, and then his initial second castle decision making. I think you're gonna beat me, and I think you're gonna beat me. Oh, now he doesn't have confidence now either. Fifty, you gotta go diagonal because the drift. Oh, and yeah, and Delicious is talking to him. She's trying to coach it through him. He's gonna like run out of MP here. Yep, get to the top. Now Wolf, Wolf in the yeah, you got a Wolf I'd on the top to there. Diagonal. Oh my god. I'm so regretting not getting that leap stone. Oh, now he's, he's yeah, here yeah. comes the self-awareness yeah, now. Okay, he, just he figured it out. Sounds like a bad time. I was going to say, are you... Um, Yesterday right? I successfully read complexity and skipped spike breaker check, and it made me uh, so dude, nervous, even is, though I knew it was right. Yeah, no, that, right. that's... It's tough. I'm just going to forfeit out of fucking rage right now. Oh no, he's going to rage quit now. It's Shit. Not picking my, it's not picking up my diagonals. Uh, he got, yeah, 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 he got there, yes. Like okay, how did game... Okay. I think he's had problems with the controller before, like but still, you gotta you gotta figure that out. I have to go right. You gotta get yourself one of these. Well, firstly, you should get the Xbox 360 controller. Otherwise, you get yourself one of these 8-bit dudes. I think they're really good. Fucking angry right now. Sorry, guys. I just. Oh, I'm he's yeah, he's yeah, he's cool. tilting now. That's the biggest thing. Don't okay. tilt. No, no. The worst fine. thing you can do to yourself in these races uh, is to tilt. Although, I mean, like uh, here, you don't need to do any more thinking. It's wet. It's yeah. so I'm not sure. And especially, I can't remember. He might be using a PlayStation controller. I think he told me before. I almost wanted to go left. Yeah, but see, he did. He the, he almost went left. That's what, yeah. And again, like I understand people not like picking up on that right away because like I only know it because I have raced with him a bunch of times. But yeah, he wanted to go left side, best side, and that would have been an even more bigger disaster. Time. No. Like okay. that section. That section on. Uh, well, I mean, we don't know if we need to watch this part here because this is going to be. It's oh. just like some of the worst fucking movement if you don't have. Dude. There we go. I'm... So he gets through. Dude, this Dude. race. And... Oh, so, what was the result? Did he. Um, did he. Um, so I'm just bringing up the race channel right now. Where was this here? Where's the 50 keys race? Yeah, so he gets third. Okay. And so he lost to Delicious by um, roughly six minutes. Like, it feels like there was six minutes of time save here for sure. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's a good lesson for him for sure. But at least he was self aware of it. And he was even self aware of the left side piece. And yeah, with the library cards and stuff like that, like yeah, there was a there was a good chance for him to go and do Aquadon. Like Diagon had a really good call there. Yeah, so what do we end up with here? Three blunders, four mistakes, six inaccuracies, one positive drop, seven good things, two excellence. 